White's Road meanders gently down Wilderness Heights, a quiet country road where Welsh ponies on the local stud farm add to the almost English charm. This lovely drive is also popular with cyclists and walkers, so expect to see them and drive with due caution. The road has gentle gradients, seldom exceeding 1 in 12, and offers magnificent views of the Tow River Gorge, the estuary, Wilderness Beach, and the village and Dolphin Point. From the northern start near a small trading store, one leaves the tower and commences the descent down White's Road at a very easy gradient of around 1 in 20. The start of White's Road can be easily located at either end as it's well signposted. Along this upper section, the gradient is very gentle and a far more comfortable drive, walk or cycle than the original Wilderness Heights Road, which is a straight climb up to the plateau with little consideration for weary legs. The road soon starts twisting and turning in harmony with the natural contours of the mountain. There are several roads leading off on both sides and these all go to private properties. After a while, the Feinbos and Heather start giving way to indigenous forests. There are some beautiful views down of the Tow River Gorge to the east, but be careful where you stop as there aren't many safe places to stop along this road. The road is peppered with corners, many of which are quite sharp, but if you comply with the speed limit, all will be well. Please note that there's a height restriction halfway along the pass, so don't go and drive this road in a high roof camper van, bus or truck. In approximately 1909, White's Road was commissioned and funded by Ernst Montague White, businessman, philanthropist and the son of Henry Fancourt White, who was the surveyor and roads inspector for the Montague Pass between George and Oatsrun. When he ran into financial dire straits, his son took over the loving restoration of his father's house, Fancourt, now a national monument at the foot of Wilderness Heights. Tragically, he and his sister died suddenly after a meal of poisonous mushrooms in 1916. At this point, the road starts curving into the south as it persistently but gently continues descending. The views start to change and soon the lakes to the east appear along with the attractive Serpentine River which is a tributary of the Tow River. Be sure to watch part 2 of White's Road. <laughs> 